We're in Costa Rica. Yeah! Country number 12. and then we'll be milling around for five months but the lovely ladies here have just said that we can check in an hour early uh, because you're supposed to do it three hours before uh, but we're a little bit early and they've said yeah that's fine come on down so yay we can drop the bags off I feel like a cart horse you don't look like one So how excited are we? We are at Gatwick Airport, a few hours before we get on a flight to San Jose in Costa Rica, where we're gonna be spending five months backpacking and showing you guys the best of Central America. We can't wait, we are so, so excited. And uh, so we're just having a coffee and relaxing before the flight, which is in about three hours time. We're off gate number 35. Always recommended to get to the plane early. We've still got about an hour to go. And uh, yeah, we've got about an 11 hour flight. Yep. So we couldn't actually get seats next to each other um, because you had to pay quite a lot of money and the flight is full. But we managed to get two aisle seats, I believe, almost opposite each other. So we'll be able to wave. So we'll be able to wave. Costa Rica, San Jose Airport, and we are waiting for our friend Vicky, who is actually um, a friend of um, Fez, one of our friends from the UK, who we are meeting uh, here in San Jose later this week. Um, so she's working at the moment, so she should be here probably in the next 20 minutes or so. Uh, very nice of her to offer a, a lift to our hostel. And yes, believe it or not, we are in a hostel tonight for four nights in a mixed dorm and Marianne's on the top bunk. Yay! <laughs> 
Much to the horror of my kids and my friends, they're all like, what are you doing? I've never ever done a hostel mixed door before, so it's something new. Marianne's just met up with Vicky, so she's just coming over now. So we have arrived in Costa Rica and Vicky and her mum have come to pick us up and rescue us from the chaos that is the airport, as always. So we're going to go in the car and um, the adventure begins! Welcome to Costa Rica! <laughs> Um, they very kindly took us to a hostel that we're staying at. Yes, and actually we're in the garden at the moment, so you might be able to hear the birds and other people chatting around us. Really nice atmosphere. It's called Trip On Open House um, Hostel. Really lovely. Um, we're in bunk beds and we're in a mixed dorm. <laughs> Granny and Granddad we'll give you, on tour. We'll give you the guided tour of the hostel in the centre um, of the city, mm -hmm. not far from the San Jose uh, University. Yes, the University of Costa Rica. And it's our first ever hostel experience. It is. We've got four days booked here, or four nights booked here. So let's go and have a look around the trip on Open House Hostel. Yay! So the hostel that we're staying at is £14 per night that we did mm -hmm. through bookings.com mm -hmm. that's for a mixed dorm mm -hmm. bunk, bunk beds. beds yeah i'm at the top chris is at the bottom hello this is my lovely bunk bed and i have a little locker up here with um i can lock things in like my telephone and little small things and then i also have a light so if i want to read i'll turn that off now because i think i've just blinded you chris behind the camera <laughs> it's okay and then i've got these lovely curtains in fact everybody's got these curtains and, um but it's really bouncy and really comfortable and it feels very solid i don't feel in any danger <laughs> <laughs> they've even got like a little bar there to stop you rolling <laughs> Um, they very kindly um, sort of moved um, a couple of groups around so that we'd be in the same room and be able to have an upstairs and, down, and a yeah, downstairs Yeah, because they were full fun. when we arrived. They were full. In fact, we met some lovely guys from Mexico and we hope to come and see you soon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we got an invite. We're on our way. Yeah, um, absolutely lovely. And uh, there's lots of different communal areas like the garden out here. Um, there's an area with a TV and some music. Um, there's another area by the reception desk where people hang out and play music. Uh, there's a guitar propped up and people just jump on mm. with a guitar. And then also they've got a pool table. Is it a snooker or a pool table? Pool. It's pool. pool. table. Yeah. Everybody's playing that in the evening. That seems like a really nice area. And then in the morning, um, the staff actually put a cover over it and put all the breakfast stuff laid out. And the breakfast Yeah, the breakfast lovely. is very cool. It's got everything that you need for a breakfast. Mm. Considering you're only paying £14 per night, yeah. it's got toast, fruit yeah. juice, Mm. Uh, cereals, fresh fruit, yep. all cu cut up, and yep. uh, endless supply of tea and coffee, which is always yes. great in the morning if you know us yeah. and our coffee addiction. Yeah. £14 for both of us um, and there's a clean sheet, the beds were very comfortable um, and you have a big locker um, mm. next to your bunk with your bunk number on it and then um, you can put all your stuff in it and then it's got a little um, lock on it um, that you then put your own padlock on or if you don't have one they'll rent you a padlock or sell you a padlock. Yeah so um, it's, al it's always good to bring a padlock with you. Yeah. We've chosen one with a, uh, with a numeric combination so mm -hmm. that you can't no, lose can't the key. Either. Yeah. Um, that's me. Um, yeah. I lose so that's things. always a good idea. Mm -hmm. um, things like, you know, when you come to a hostel, bring your own towel. Mm -hmm. um, although yeah. they, they do provide them, but yeah. it will be an, an additional charge. Yeah. The other fabulous thing about this wonderful hostel is they've got a kitchen that you can use. And they've got a cooker, they've got a microwave, they've even got like a guest fridge with clear instructions about labelling your food. They empty it if it's not labelled or um, if it's not stored correctly, which is great. 
They've got a wonderful setup of mugs and cups and knives and chopping boards and everything. It's really super clean. The ladies are constantly cleaning around the area. So it's a lovely, lovely setup. So if you like hostels, as much as we're starting to feel about hostels, this is a very cool one. Uh, so we're, we're here for four nights and um, we're not really sure what the plan is after those four nights at the moment. <laughs> So until the next time from Costa Rica. Costa Rica. Costa Rica. Oh, pura oh. vida. Pura vida. Yeah, you have to say that apparently. Pura vida is the word for everything. 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 Hello, goodbye, Everything's thank great. you. Everything's great, thank Everything's you. Great. It's wonderful, loving it. Pura vida. Yeah, pura vida. <laughs> so, uh, we arrived at uh, Gatwick Airport found our no my tongue is swollen i think okay right go. three two one back in the room <laughs> cut <laughs> she's taking pictures of my food while i'm trying to do a video leaving this place the sun's about to break you're riding shotgun